their time indoors. Americans spend approximately 90% of their time indoors. This means that most of us are constantly living in tightly sealed spaces in a toxic bubble of sorts. Although air pollution is typically regarded as an outdoor concern, the fact is that indoor levels of pollutants can be two to five times higher than outdoor pollutant levels and can be 100 times higher in some cases according to the Environmental Protection Agency. While it's true that the right amount of ventilation with fresh, clean air can reduce the levels of indoor air pollution, this isn't an efficient way to protect yourself and your family. What causes indoor air pollution? There are a number of things that can cause indoor air pollution, including various molds, building materials, carpeting, air fresheners, personal care products, tobacco smoke, and one of the biggest causes of all, common household cleaners. Most people don't realize just how toxic their household cleaning products are. Hundreds of potentially dangerous chemicals are emitted by household cleaning agents. Fortunately, there are steps you can take to reduce indoor air contaminants, including the following. Avoid using over-the-counter toxic cleaning products and air fresheners in general. Don't use more than one cleaning product at a time on the same cleaning task, and be sure to read the instructions for use. Always ensure that you have adequate ventilation, not only while you clean, but for several hours afterward. Store anything you used along with your cleaning products like sponges, paper towels, and mops away from your home's living and dining areas even after you've cleaned and rinsed them. Alleviate indoor pollution problems by choosing non-toxic, all-natural cleaning products. Learning how to regulate your home's environment will not only lower allergen levels, but help protect you from other respiratory illnesses and health complications that have been associated with indoor air pollution. Using non-toxic household cleaners will go a long way towards safeguarding you and your family's health.